it's a fairly even matchup. Um, uh, it does look like NTN that. does have four players, so I I'm not sure where they're. Well, they have, is. Oh, there we they go. Have five. I think they were just subbing. Idiot. My bad, Pineapple. Uh -huh. Ah. So uh, let's see if uh, Godset changes up their strategies from the last couple of games. And it does look like they're just gonna straight up push B. Thoughts from the previous games, the the the, 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 oh the strategy they had last game was to sit in B main and just wait for them to rotate. Yeah. It wasn't very effective. But it looks like they I are gonna be pushing this this fist around. They are gonna get taken out by Nicholas. Nicholas already with a three yes. headshot kill. Okay, yeah. So now that Maple is the only person alive, their strategy last game was to just 1v1 on every occasion, which was just not gonna work out against Getflush. That's why they lost all those rounds that were actually winnable, most of them. But it does look like Maple will be able back. to get two kills. He does have a little bit of space, but Nicholas is going to be holding the bomb. Holding a tight so angle. Epic, bro. It's going to be whoever sees each other first wins. Yo, he wins. He wins. Yo! <laughs> Maple already with three kills. He has a potential chance of winning this. He has bomb. And he is going to rotate god, towards bro. A. Such a god. Spar is going to realize that and he's going to rotate right away. Maple already in A main. Popping his way onto site. Does look like Spar does know that he's out. And he is going to challenge him. Oh no. Maple goes for oh, no. the plant. Maple! No! <laughs> Unfortunate. Godset does get the bomb plant, which means they will they will be able to have enough money Whoa, to buy Maple. on the third round. Maple, hmm, that's some toxic language over there, Maple. <laughs> Anyways, we'll we'll ignore that. All right. So yeah, it does look like uh, Godset will be buying this round. I'm not sure why they were they're doing that. That uh, they they bought when they got a bomb plant, meaning that they will be they will need to save another round, which Fuck's sake. wouldn't be very uh which wouldn't be very convenient for them. Oh, did they force? Hell yeah! I think we're gonna need to uh ban Maple for racism on stream. Whoa! <laughs> Two seasons. Permanent ban. Hello. D Maple does take out a player. He's going to push tree, get taken out by tank on. By the left with the trade. It's gonna be 3v2. <laughs> These side pistols are easy when you have Castler's ESP. <laughs> <laughs> so NTN currently on a retake. 2v2. Luza finds a finds a finds a player, but he gets taken out. It's gonna be by the left in a 1v2 situation, and Cast is able to secure the round. That's gonna be another bomb plant for for, for Godsent. That means they could buy this round, and they do. They have enough money to buy AKs Stop. and head armor, so it looks like they will be buying this round. Anything Why you wanna stirring, say? Bro? Shut up, Pondable. I didn't ask you. Why are you stirring? Yo, G Yo, Faker, hello? Hello? Yes? What is it, my, my <laughs> fellow gamer? Alright, so it does look like Godsent is going to be doing a split push. A default play right here. By the left, it's gonna drop bomb down middle. Not sure why he's gonna do that. Bomb will be in the open. He's gonna need to risk exposure in order to get that bomb. Right now they're just playing for Wait, picks, what? which is actually, which is actually pretty smart. They, it looks like they've they've improved from their last couple of games. Wow. Sure, have lots of experience, Baker. Yeah, Royal <laughs> with a Magnum. Oh my God. <laughs> Who's that? Fuck's sake. So Yo, it does look like, uh, it does look like, um, 
Godsent will be hanging outside I mean waiting for a push. They're just playing time right now, waiting for for any any over aggression from the CTs. Royal uh, already f fairly pushed up towards B. He does find a player, does take him out. Gets traded by Nicholas. Yo, he got a kill with the R8. What a god. By the left and Maple are going to be working towards A. Kidder does hear some sound. And it's just going to oh, be a shit. simple anchor hold there. <sighs> and Kidder with two kills. He just kills. got lit, bro. He got laid in secure, Faker. Yeah, it does happen he quite often on, on Roblox. Yeah. Yeah, bro. That's what I'm saying. Looks like Godsent will be on a weird buy. Some of the players will be able to buy AK. Some of them will not. We'll see how they figure this one out. So far, it does look like they are going to be buying. They're going to force buy this round. Royal with 5k, 5.8k. Not sure what he's saving that money for, but probably for an op. Whoa. Okay, I see how... Wait, did they remaster the intertwine? Wait, hold up. Maple finds Nicholas. He's going to take taken and takes him out. Has an M4. Oh shit, they got kills? Maple, what a god. It's gonna be a 3v5 retake for, for NTN. Oh, 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 spar so bad. Ah. He smoked himself. He's sitting in the smoke, bro. 1v5 retake. Oh, he he, he Whips a shot. Whips a shot. A Gets taken out by Phil. Ah, so bad, bro. Yeah, and that's gonna be the first round for, for Godsent. Uh, Pondable. The the well, what, what, what do you think of the yeah, game so far? What do you think of the early couple rounds so far? Any um, comment? I mean, I wasn't really paying attention. Um, currently winning. So, I'm gonna win. They're gonna win more. <laughs> Well, that, that's very, uh, that's very, um, that's a lot of, uh, information that you, you've provided us, um. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it looks no like problem. Spar will be taking out two players on middle. Maple and Lusa goes down. It's gonna be a 3v5 situation Shit. for, for Godsend. Godsend. Lusa again with, with the complaining. Planes. Spar on a 3k It's gonna be right pushing now. towards B-Main. Spar on a 4k, he can actually get the A. And he doesn't because he's trash. <laughs> Terrible player. Very unfortunate. He is he is top ranking, yeah. but that, that 4k does bring him to the, the top of the leaderboard. Bro, we made Alt Mystic leave. What happened? We gotta spice it up, Faker. Alright, my man. <laughs> So yeah, after I see you, Amer. I see you. So yeah, after this game, um, it's gonna be Dropbox versus Outlaws, which is gonna be an interesting game. My very own team it's versus the... uh -huh. Outlaws. Yeah, I think I that's. Think... I think that would be a yes. little bit more more exciting than than this game. I, I'm gonna be a honest, little bit more exciting. Boring. Yeah, Outlaws above you. Oh yeah, by right. one point. All right. Two forfeit wins, by the way. That, that was very unfortunate. Kind of. Yeah, you're BS. bad. You're, you're nah, bad. Nah, I don't think so. See, I'm on death, man. Bad. God sent. We'll be working their way towards A. They're gonna be working with full Let's aggression. Five. Here. All five players are on A. They're gonna hard push it. Takes out the anchors. It's gonna be a four v two situation. Spar does take out Phil with an op. Very low HP. Bad, Spar bro. does get a whopping. And that's gonna be another round for Godsend. They're gonna start bringing this back. Like I said, I think it, after I, after bro, their, I their think... early game, after the early okay. game, Godsend will be taking it back into mid game. Kidder should stick to skin making. <laughs> well, that, that's very toxic, Pineapple. What, what's wrong with <laughs> today, man? Bro, I'm just I'm just saying. Just saying. <laughs> He's three and four. Not that bad, though. I wouldn't say he he's the worst. 
drop X versus Outlaws is actually an awesome match because they're big rivals. Uh, you could say that. I don't think we're much of a rivals. <laughs> Honestly. For an Outlaws, I wouldn't really call it Outlaws. They like rebranded mid season to Outlaws. Yeah. But the left takes on Nick, list on middle. They're gonna take full mid control here a bit. Take on does take mid control back from Godsend. And it's gonna be the last two Godsend players in A main. It's gonna be a 2v2. Yo, they what's are gonna the rotate. fucking snowflake pin? Yeah. Why the left leaves the server? I'm not sure why he did that. Um, probably some He's, technical yo, issues. Stay, stay, stay mad, bro. Uh, Punable, come on, man. You gotta focus. So, Spar does he... catch a player off guard. It's gonna be bomb hunt for Godsent, though. Oh, now in a 1v2. And it's gonna be a retake for, for NTN. Bro is gonna peek that. Whoops. a shot. And he's gonna be punished by Spar. It's gonna be a round for Who NTN. Who do you think is gonna win uh, Get Flush versus Flashpoint? I feel like Get Flush will take the game quite easily. Shit, wrong match. Um, drop X or Outlaws? Uh, I believe. My team will win. <laughs> Ignore the previous match. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Your team? Wow. Is that an is that a non-biased opinion? Non-biased opinion. The reason why I say that is because non -biased. I feel like our roster is more experienced and they're they're more better. Prepared, yeah. <laughs> they're prepared for this season, so I feel like they're gonna take the the win. But okay. other than that, I I feel like Outlaws will definitely put up a good fight. They're they're a really strong team as well. Yeah. They're yeah. also very experienced. Quite a few experienced players on Outlaws. Uh huh. So who's winning? Who's winning the game the right now? Match. Or yeah, uh, NTN yeah. will be winning the game. Will be. Um. Okay. They are currently winning the game, and they will be winning the current game. My prediction. Yeah, that's what I meant. That, yeah, my prediction. Meant. My prediction for this game is going to be a nice 16-12 for NTN. I feel like Godsent will be putting up a really good fight. Nicholas will be leaving the server. Not sure why he did that. Probably a rage quit. Yep, probably. Yeah, most likely a rage quit. Milpool takes out two players on A. That's going to be A control for for Godsent. Why are these fools leaving? So good, bro. Yeah, now it's going to be a 1v2 for Spire. Both of the Godsent players on A. Tier player. Not sure what they're doing right now. What what are they doing? Are they do they have bomb? It's, um, Oze, you ain't uh, promoting shit in my stream. I'm sorry, buddy. SMH, bro. What did Oze say? Was it was it toxic? Ma Man was promoting his Fortnite stream, bro. Oh. <laughs> Unfortunate. So it looks like it's gonna be a 4v4. This is gonna be um, a weird game. My opinion, this game is so far is pretty boring. It's not very uh, exciting. Whoa! Hold up, bro. Hopefully, the the next game why, will why be exciting. Well, is, first of all, there's nothing nothing why? interesting happening. It's just like both teams are pushing and they're nothing just yeah. Huh? Bro. There's no there's no like. Thrill watching this game. Can't say that, bro. You can say whatever oh, I want. His shots. Yo, man. What are they doing? What is Godsent doing? They're just. Why is Phil just crouching out in the open? That that that's my concern. Looks like they will be eco. I... Lose now in the one v one v two now. Rosie's around quad. Bomb is down. He is gonna get flanked by Tacon, but Lusa's yeah, gonna spot that bro. right away. Look at this. Oh shit, no. The timing, the timing oh. though. Lusa gets taken out. The timing was ridiculous. Very unfortunate. And that's gonna be around for NTN. Unfortunate. Why, why did DropX not win RSL Season 2? Mm. My opinion, we weren't really. We weren't really looking forward for a season two. We weren't really prepared.
Kind of, I'll, be kind of <laughs> I'll be honest. Yeah, we, we didn't really want it to play because yeah. at the time the game yeah, wasn't how, that how much, uh, functional. Wanna, you want to talk about how much we received in PayPal? <laughs> oh. Uh... <laughs> Let's not talk about that. Anyways, uh, Godsent will be working towards B. They do have garage control and B main control. Phil will be in Sunroom. He should be holding for any aggressive pushes, and it does look like Godsent will be rotating towards A. Not sure what their their initial plan right here is. But Maple does find one on site. He's going to try and find the second. But he is going to push this guy on site. He is going to get taken out by Kidder with the XM. Oh shit, Kidder. What a god. Castro with a kill on Lusa. Now that's another player. Bro, now in a now in a situation right there. Had two HP and he died. Phil turns that 1v4 into a 1v3. He is going to try and take that bomb, take the site, single handedly. And this is a chance for him to clutch up the round for his team, but oh. who knows? I he might be able to win this, he might not. I feel like he won't, just based on his position right now. No bugs, you're not speaking on the stream bugs. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Punable. You can't be moderating and, and commentating at the same time, my man. This is that that's oh, not how it works. Here. Yes, what am I supposed to do? Ignore them? <laughs> just just DM it's them or something, my man. So looks like Phil does get another player player and it's gonna be a one v two. Fifteen seconds left. And Kidder is going to end the round. Gonna be a seven three score line for, for NTN. Godsend so we've talked struggling. about about season two. What do you think went wrong for Dropex back in season one? Back in season one? Well, first of all, uh, Blast Tech happened, so uh, Zinio decided to uh, snake and uh, take all the players. Well, accusations. Accusations. Oh yeah. But uh, yeah, overall we, need, we were we, need... we were all f we were all family. Um, I believe it was just like a fun game. Uh, Back in season one, fun game. Uh, yeah, and why'd really... you why'd you lose the split? Why'd you lose the split against split? against Proxy? Why'd you lose against Proxy? RSO split. I'm pretty sure we won though, but whatever. Pro proxy won. <laughs> <laughs> Team Proxy. So it does look like uh, Godsend will be working towards B site. Yo, it was all laws, not proxy. Proxy's trash. Yeah, exactly. I it told you, we never lost the proxy. Jesus, SMH. Luz is gonna find another player in a 1v3 situation again. Takes this out Kidder. Such an interesting game. Yeah, it looks like Godsend is just playing for clutches right now. They, they've been clutching for the past couple rounds. It's not very, uh. Yeah. I mean, Dropex has a history of just taking a f big, massive L. What do you mean? <laughs> Isn't that right, Vic? Nah. I mean, we've always been on top. Always, always the top teams. Uh, right. But then, then the finals. Uh huh. Then the finals happen. Uh. Us was rightfully disqualified back in season four, allowing you to play versus Alpha Esports, a very bad opponent. No, I believe they. I believe they were very, very, um, very good. Because they had this one player named Punable who decided to sleep during the finals. I'm not sure why he did that, but he decided to sleep during the finals and he lost yo, the game. Yo, for his hold team. up, bro. That's toxic. <laughs> All right, Punable. Now, now that you're, now that you wanna talk about the game that is currently going on, that that would be very nice. Game not very interesting. Yeah, I know. <laughs> but you still gotta do our jobs, my man. Bro, we can't be talking Al about Alpha previous... Drop X was more interesting, bro. <laughs> that is true. Bro, send very mean words in my DMs. Very mean words, I guess. <laughs> Sleep is more important. No, I think I think Roblox sees go is more important, my man. <laughs> Let's be real. Fakers, so what happened back in season three? Why'd you lose the finals? What went wrong? 
Alright, Punimal. I'll go. <laughs> Alright, Punimal. I'm just gonna meet you from there on. Yo. <laughs> so, Godsend will be working towards A site. Royal will be outside of Long. They're just outside of uh, A main, I mean. Fuck. Long. <laughs> Anyways, um, they are gonna work towards A. Yeah, I do have a player push up highway. Phil does catch Kidder off guard. Takes, gets taken out by Nicholas. Castro is going to anchor the site. Takes out all three players, and that's going to be another round for NTN. 10-3 scoreline. That's going to be a seven-point lead. Punable, I am Why did... I am muting you. Why did drop picks? Okay, nah, I'm muting you. Nah. Alright. Anyways. That is going to be another round for NTN. They're going to pull this consistently off. It's 4v5 right now. Godsent needs another player. I'm not sure where their fourth player, fifth player is, but looks like they are going to be missing a player. Not sure why any kind of anybody would would decide to leave their team mid match. That just shows the disorganization there. Godsent will be working towards it. It's going to be full. I mean B. It's going to be a full B push. Attack on with the hold. It's gonna be two v three. Lusa and Phil, last two alive, gets taken out by Spar. And Lusa now in a one v three situation again. This is another clutch situation. I'm not sure why this is happening. Lusa might be just baiting his team blatantly because he's been clutching these these like in a in a one v three whatever situation for the past couple rounds now. This is not a very stable team. Oh, uh, this is very, uh, this is very boring. I'm not sure about the chat, but this is, this is just very, very boring. I, I just don't like this game at all. Nothing interesting is, is happening in this game. It's just, it's just very boring. I'm not experiencing, experiencing much, uh, much interest right now. Godsent will be working towards A mid. They're gonna take mid control. And it's about time they do because now they, they I, I pretty, I'm pretty sure they figured out how to how to push and execute in sight. But Spar will be anchoring mid, holding it. It's gonna prevent Godsent from pushing mid. But Phil does take out Spar, and that's gonna be mid control for for Godsent. Now they just need to decide where they're going. Looks like they are gonna work towards A. Full mid control. They have bomb. They get to decide where we're to go, but Kidder does take out two kills on Royal and Phil. They both line up. It's gonna be a situational moment right here. Maple takes out Kidder. Castro still on on A site, still holding on quad. Does find a player, but doesn't finish the kill. Whiffs a, cu whiffs a couple shots. Spots a player at truck. The Maple goes down. Lusa again in another clutch situation this man is just baiting just straight up baiting he's not he does not give a crap he, his team is probably mad at him right now it's not doing much for the team so yeah it's gonna be a half 12 3 score line for ntn god sent with uh with a couple problems right here they're in a 4v5 situation they're missing a player def especially on ct which is going to be problematic because they're going to need Total five players to have a strong hold, but it doesn't look like that's gonna happen. Punable is gonna try and kick me from the game, but I don't think that's gonna happen. And uh, yeah, this is gonna be a split push or a full on concentrated B push for, for NTN right now. They're gonna be pushing towards B. Maple is gonna hear it. Godsent will be rotating, and his teammates are already. Helping him out, but it does look like Maple won't be able to hold the site. Lusa and Maple both get taken out. Oh, Phil finds a player under heaven, but and takes him out. Royal on the rotate. Now it's gonna be a 1v2 situation right here. Kidder, 17 HP. Gets taken out taken out by Phil, and that's gonna be another round. That's gonna be a victorious pistol round for, for Godsent.
So, uh, Parbo, what do you what do you think of this game so far? Um, I think it's very interesting. <laughs> why Why is it interesting? Because because uh, Godsend is pulling an alpha. Or... Um, I think Faker. Faker, I think it's because did you and Ina throw during RSL draft league? <laughs> we're just gonna we're just gonna mute him right there. Um, <laughs> we'll take this off stream. Don't worry about that. So it looks like NTN will be doing a full A push right here. Phil is gonna get traded, and that's gonna be A site two v four right now. One v four. Maple now in a very Hectic situation right now. Has a FAMAS. He's also in a very bad position right now. I don't think he's going to win this. But he could pull the impossible right here. He is going to work towards A main. Takes a shortcut. That's a very good move in there. Finds a player, but whips the shot. Kills Castro, though. In midair, he, he gets taken out by Spar. 13-4. Right, new co-commentators here, Faker. What's going all on? Alright, Aimer. Alright. Glad to have all you right, on the stream. Yeah, Link and move Miggy in. Hey, Hell hey, yeah. Hey. We got the trio. Let's hey, fucking go. Alright, guys. Make this game interesting. Of course. Yeah, Link. Yeah. Honestly, though, it's just Link. a group stage game. We're just kind of waiting for Dropex to come play. Faker, oh, yeah. what do you think about Dropex? It's my team. Yes. <laughs> All right. So, in your unbiased opinion, what do you think about Dropex? In my unbiased opinion, all right. So, I believe Dropex will be able to win the game against Outlaws because they have a more stacked roster. They have experienced players, and uh, majority of the players on Dropex has won a season before, and they're all really good players. So, I I honestly believe that they're going to be able to win this mm -hmm. game. Mm -hmm. Some of the players on Dropex have some of the best chemistry in, in this community, yeah. and I kid you not, they like yeah, they will be right. able to 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 win this game. Yo, you're not aiming your team to lose, bro. <laughs> so, so Faker, do you think your team is gonna be able to do it without the help of Meggy in the final? I believe so. I believe so. Miggy is a star player. I, I believe he is the best player in the game currently. <laughs> sorry, hey, Aimer. Right, sorry, right, Aimer. Right. But I, I believe Miggy is the best player in the game at the moment. I'm really sorry for that. But yeah, without him, I believe uh, the team will have a, a little bit of a disadvantage, but we'll still bring it back on top. And uh, yeah, we'll see when uh, we get to the finals. Alright, so uh, I'm sure we'll be seeing you in that game, yeah? Uh, I don't think so. I gave up my spot so uh, we can have a an even better roster. Faker, some would say that you're one of the top Canadian players. Why would you bench yourself? Uh, I mean, Canada doesn't have good players. I'll be honest with you. Our our CB community is quite small compared to the other communities like. Brazil and in the United States, but yeah. Some would say you're better than Aimer. Also, okay. Oh yeah. And you agree? Weak, weak. Alright, so it's gonna be Lusa again in a clutch situation. This is like, I don't know, the sixth time this game, the seventh time this game where, he, where he's in a clutch situation where he's alone. Just beating out his team. It's gonna work well, towards a site. On this retake. Some... Uh, are you guys in the game? <laughs> no, no one sent me the link. Alright, I'll send you the link in a second. So, so hear me out, right, Faker? Some might not even say that, like, Mickey's the best player in Florida. Uh, uh... How's he gonna be the best player? Are we gonna have, like, a little fight on stream right now? Or are you two gonna, like, have a boxing match or something? <laughs> Mickey will do nothing, bro! Yo, you wanna bet? Yo! Yeah, Yo, chill, yo, chill! <laughs> uh, thank you for the link, Faker. Is yeah. this a best of three? This is a best of one. So, yeah, this is gonna be the last round, I believe. Uh, Fantastic, I'll be able to win this. Round. 
my god. Don't worry, you'll, you'll commentate the last round. At least you made the, the game a little bit interesting. She's in a 2 v so, retake. So what's, uh, uh, what's Get Flush's uh, roster looking like? Do you know Faker? Oh uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure some of their players are going to be missing because of technical problems. Um, yeah. Are, are you saying you're going to DDoS some of the players? <laughs> no, no, I'm not saying that. I Yo, Bonneville, you hearing that. this? <laughs> Wait a minute. Uh, can we get... Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, that's going to be yeah. game. NTN will be able to take this game, and that's going to be a victory, a 16-4 victory for NTN. Godsend will be able will be will 